That's why uh, she came in prepared for that block. Yeah, we'll try again. Mm. This time, a sharper. Scouting Ateneo for a week mm -hmm. because of that uh, downtime from all the games. And it's been paying off dahil nga yung blocking nila is only reflective of how well they know the attacking uh, capabilities of Ateneo. Yeah, especially because they're not really a good block blocking team. They're only number six mm -hmm. in the rankings dito sa UAP as we get into this exchange, which is still not done. Very tight. Pasia sent back. She will try again. And Carnason bump set to Petalio. Goes long. Doromal was there. Tax goes to Minor. That's too low. And Carnason chases. Petalio hits. Back set to De Guzman. Ending the long exchange and keeping themselves in the fight. Scoring off from the opposite side. It's actually the second time she did that on this rotation. Ball still alive. Good defense. I think you'll get a chance again to go. There's a proper setup to Lian de Guzman. Dongalio with a nice pass. Cepada. Dug by Zell. Castillo read that one. UE. Lian wanting to go longer. Okay, it's a solid block, but finally, wala siya dun, no? Hindi nakapag block si Nagale, so. Corner pocket shot for Lian. And uh, we're seeing quality exchanges here between Ateneo and Adamson in this fourth set. And a tip, red by Ver the floor. Ball over. Ateneo reset. The one hand. Oh, ball still alive. Nika going solo there. Here's a chance for Ateneo. De Guzman timing it, and she finds a hole in the middle of Adamson's court. And Ateneo fans on their feet already. They let that third set slip away, and it looks like Ateneo bound and determined. So big. Shot serve. 4 0 run for Ateneo. They're looking for 5 0, but it's still alive here. Fujimoto opens up. De Guzman powers it through. Look at Lian De Guzman really flying high and hitting that ball hard. Top bigger of the league can get to that. Spike of the set brought to you by Duncan. Pasalubok ng bayan. Speaking of, that's a tricky serve handled well by Ateneo. Look at Dian de Guzman flying and scoring. It was such a clean hit. Let's we take a look at that again. 12 points. Blue Eagles to eat a run. Push coming from Balingit. Back row de Guzman. Ooh, that's on the line. Liam de Guzman. And you mentioned how they need to get her involved even if she's in the back row. But the approach are very similar, where they want to mentor the girls and really um, work on their fundamentals. Oh, de Guzman. Oh, but you have to give credit to Nashima. She was there at the right time. Would have been another point for a crazy Madriaga. Statistics for the sa digging. What about that dig of Verde Flor? <laughs> Easy peasy. And it's the Guzman getting the bulk of the touches. And I think that is also expected by Adamson. And finally, she gets one in. Munson Ball gets us going for this rally. KC in the middle. Postrillo is denied. Joust. De Guzman swipes it. The dive by Monares. Chance to reconstruct this offense. It bounces off. Saved by UP. Pustrillo. Access denied. Locks, attacks, aces, but this time. Sobrang ganda ng penetration niya doon. 
it really landed on uh, the people of a run. Popped up by Nisperos. De Guzman tries to go for a swipe. It comes in anyway. Saving one set point. Very foul. And uh, getting creative with their attacks. And that says a lot. I mean, coming from another setter mm. like you. What discipline, what composure as well for these young Lady Red Warriors. But a nice start, uh, De Guzman with a push, her 16th point. When it's 1-1, it feels like zero, like yeah. you just started. That's a good point. Chance ball here, Yui will go again. That bounces back. Good coverage, though, by the Warriors. Cortez looking for De Guzman with Ooh. a tip. Great placement shot. Nobody home at the front there for UE. Down on Lian De Guzman to really use her IQ and just give an easy ball, an easy point for her team. The instructions of Coach Sergio in this pass. Again, they are targeting Lian De Guzman. Ooh. But... She actually uses it to her advantage. She got set up. Alam niya nakabantay din yung blockers. Look at that. Targeting area behind the blockers. Manuel. Really, somebody needs to take up that scoring role. Mm. And we know who's doing that on the side of Ateneo. She already has 12. And uh, we talked about how she really is... One of the top 10 scorers in the league, number seven. Kasabayan, the AC Minor, Pumasok Dito, the Ateneo Volleyball Program, Itang. Goes for the drop. She did not even telegraph that. Uh, oh, sorry, she telegraphed that rather. 0.6 points a match. Talking about Panangin. Saan agad binigay? Tax. Okay, Minor Naman! And the middles have come alive. They're down by two. UE three points away from winning their second straight set. De Guzman against a single blocker. Got it. 15 points for De Guzman, making it a one-point game. Uh, Liam De Guzman didn't force a down the line attack, uh, seeing that the blockers were late. I can see, I can feel her aura. Good read there by Ateneo. Aysepada again, dug by Buena on the back to Guzman now. Good pick up by the libero. One more time for the Guzman. Smart moves from Leon de Guzman. Just varying her attacks. Yeah, a simple tip ball behind the blockers. It was already an out of system play. So 25 all. Second set point saved. De Guzman. Doug, Ateneo reloads to De Guzman again. Third set point. Actually, the first one could have uh, already resulted to a point, but uh, great digging by Perdigo on the second time around. Way behind Manuel. Nakakasira ng timing sa depensa yung net, ano? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yan De Guzman again. This Continuing time, with oh. the transition yeah. team, and not a lot of players are comfortable sa ulit-ulit na paggawa yun kasi nakakapagod, di ba? Moving one piece or another, pa block ka pa, but no signs of exha exhaustion from the Guzman as we go. They are through. really good defensively, but uh, that zone one has been empty on the side of Adamson. So they have to put at least uh, one woman there. Now Ateneo will have another chance to attack. Yes, a smart play from Leon de Guzman coming from the right side this time. So, you know, when you have these tips and these uh, off speeds, you cal yung calculation mo kung sa mapababang sa yung bola. And Leon did it. That's a tough set. Popped up by Ateneo. But another chance for UP, another set point here. Palikay Postrillo, bumalik ang bola! Ganda ng bantay doon, he even moved. Parang uh, that set was uh, right in front of her. 
the men in the penetration. Down two sets to none. And Maxon Ball will finish this game if it ends here with a, a lot to think about. And this is going to be a learning experience, definitely, for you. Take a swan. Baldo waiting for that. Second block point of Ateneo. Because right now, the offense of uh, the Lady Warriors is working well for them. Not a good pass there. Cortez pops it up to Guzman. And finally gets the side out. Locker in Madriaga. Making sure he attacks on top of her to get that ball. The ball and the point. It's 13-10. Coach oh, Sergio nice. making sure that they get it right. Wala pa yatang Tito. You, where the center was going, she read that set so well. Was a smart move. Second point for Ivana Sulit. That's an overpass and an easy put away. Leandro Guzman with five now and a 2 nothing start for the Blue Eagles. They only scored 12 points, but now they are up by two points. So they have to be able to sustain that. Energy. There's a bit of a breathing room for the Lady Bulldogs, which they didn't have in the previous set. The Guzman. Hardy was there. Belen. Clips the net. The Guzman. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't have to be as strong. Great angle there for the Guzman. Ateneo looking to extend us to a fifth set. Bianca asking for it. Tegusman with a swing, saw the open spot, and we're all tied up. Spotter, the way she plays in a round one, now evident here in set number four, the Equalize USD 17 all. Ateneo, in the meantime, now scoring off of their blocks. Talagang nakabantay ang mga blockers ng Ateneo doon. Walang makalagpas sa kanila. Lian de Guzman. On the side of Adamson. Huegos will come in for the first time. And double substitution here. Adolfo and Alcantara. Enjoying. And they're loose. They're playing loose. Oh, good pick up there by Tax. Another chance here. And along with that. Great save. That's a tough one. Doramal again going down to save that one. There was Man looking for down the line. Shot, she gets it. Corner pocket again. Great numbers for Roma Doramal. Yes, that some former game, teammates yeah, pala. Know, no? yung, fami yung familiarity na doon. No? Yung mga batch na nakasama niya pa. Looking for uh, a better performance out of Roma dahil na nakita naman natin. You know, yeah. challenging Coach Ramil. And uh, the players continued to improve from then on. Developing, uh, developing players. Na report ngayon in Rocio. And imagine losing of Annie Gander and Fitness Peros and producing players who can produce as much as 20 points. Oh, and it doesn't stop there. That spike of the set. For uh, Tagao, the nephew, as they trailed by two points here in the second set. Pop set. Chance to counter. Down two. Petalio in front. Denied! What an adjustment by Coach Sherio. Guess what, partner? That's the first block point of Ateneo in this match. Reflecting on this season, she's really been focusing on this co-captain role, and it's enabled her to discover her leadership style, which consists of a lot of one-on-one -on -one conversations with her Blue Eagles. Leanne also emphasizes a lot of count accountability within her squad, saying, I can't expect things so an opportunity for the girls to showcase their leadership skills. As assistant coach Doc Ovet also added, it's better that it's coming from the players themselves. They know best what's happening inside the court. The Our U Lady Warriors really have. It's just they're not able to maximize it yet. Or maybe they're a growing team. And look at that It looks like uh, this is uh, the kind of game they have in mind. The Blue Eagles. And look at the confidence of the coach. Din. One of the most improved players. 
on the side of Ateneo. I believe it's East 85 who scored the main time as well, but now second top scorer of the team as well. And you know, on the side of Ateneo, I think he's really sticking to the game plan. This is now the biggest lead at nine points for DLSU to Guzman. A smart idea to change it up. So she has to take it upon herself to be able to rise up to the challenge. Any right now, the advantage is they're blocking. Yeah. But uh, let's see, parang unahan mangyayari here in the second set. Nabut pa ni Bello. Extension of this set continues. Bono transfers to Bombita. Belen. Battle of the net. On the side of the Blue Eagles now. De Guzman. Second try is good. And Ateneo takes the lead. Today, it seems like extended uh, sets yeah. are a thing. Yes. We've seen this in uh, the previous uh, match. Right, right. Sa social media ka lang marin manono, di mo makikita yung uh, mga ganito. 17 14. Poyos, Doug, by Buena. De Guzman on the counter was a bit long, but it still drops in. Hesitation from Birdie though to let that ball go. Yun din, kaya natagalan kasi ang daming balik balik ng bola. Hindi nila mahanap, which um, part of that rally. Anyway, back to play. Atenea with a two point lead early in this first set. Late pancake save or attempt there. Three points out of their attacks. Five of their eight points came from the unforced errors of the Blue Eagles. Well, this is going to be an easy one for Ateneo. Let's see if they can extend their lead. The Guzman is waxing hot too. Boys winning this second set that they keep on in this match. Yung spiker niya na si Encarnacion na dapat nasa open, si Natanya ay katabi niya rin doon sa zone 2. At uh, kaya sumese niya si Coach O na mag-usap. Open. Lian, cross court. You know, checking in that game kasi we heard Coach Serio saying over and over to attack the ball. As in, uh, as much as possible, iniiwasan niya yung nagda-drop ball yung mga yung mga bata but uh, it's been very effective for them kaya now makikita mo power spikes talaga but apart from uh, also getting points from kill plus just look at minor oh. that gap absolutely and that causes coach O to Oof. barely made it the Guzman going for the swipe Tagawad Tax opens up. De Guzman again. This time, just the right push, just the right height, and just the right touch. De Guzman is doing that in this game, and it works well for her. Karina puro matataas eh. Parang matataas yung mga... Miss you there. You can look at the same of Pasha. Sepada has been trying to target zone one, but uh, still not successful there. That's a little low for the very tall. Uh, that set of uh, Madrigaga was so well read uh, by Liang De Guzman. She was all over Nogales in the previous rally. I guess the game has no bearing, yep. non-bearing game. Yeah, because they have already uh, finalized the final four. Yep. So but, tricky this game. Mm -hmm. We remember in, their, in the last round, UE. Being Ateneo, 